Hello, 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 and welcome to Psy Divine. I hope all is well with you and yours. All right. I won't hold you up with all of the semantics and things over here and look over there. Um, let's just dive right on in to you, our sons, and forgive me for the delay. I am dog city and it is wild anyways all right water signs hmm. so first thing here is peachy keen so things might be going okay or you may be wanting that condition so i'm gonna do a quick general reading of your energy at this time and for the month of May. And I'll take your signs individually. So, okay, so we've got masculine energy here. What's going on with you? Mm. I feel like you're staying above the haters. Or remember to do that for better mental health. Um, in the month of May, uh, water signs, masculine or feminine. You're going to hear the haters in a different voice, in a different tone. Oh. All right, part of the awakening. So in the month of May, you're going to really hear the difference in who you are and who they are, whoever they is. Now this could be they as in friends or groups, um, people you might pay attention to normally. Ooh. So you have options, okay, you know, not tons, but it's being a part of chaos. It's being a part of chaos or um, it could be heart over connections, the approval of others, friendships that have a different weight. Water signs in the month of May. You're going to you're going to see who's controlled. Who speak somebody okay. In the month of May, you're going to be hearing, I think this really just goes back here, you're going to be hearing people in a way that you will realize you don't want in your orbit. You don't want anything to do with it. You don't um, want to be a part of it. And in order to reach that decision, I feel like water signs you might have to accept or hear that chaotic nature within yourself too. Ew. In the month of May, somebody is not friends with the group anymore. Somebody is detaching from a connection. It feels like um, not wanting to be a part of the group's bullshit. Um, now, this, now, if it's not bullshit, if it's not all that, then you just don't want to be a part of the fuckery or the... What I just heard is contamination. Wow. So you might um, realize the toxicity 
of an environment. It doesn't necessarily feel like work though. Weird. So this could be a toxic environment in friendships, groups, connections. Um, partners. Um, somebody also is going to get going to have your fill of a masculine ego. Somebody is going to have enough of a masculine energy, selfish energy in the month of May. Going to be tired of bumping heads. Oh. Okay, you're going to be tired of bumping heads with people who just choose to never see the light. There's no light in their tunnel. Um, if, if the elevator does go to the top floor, there's no light in the elevator. Um, okay. And so while um, in the month of May, someone, maybe a lot of y'all is going to be waiting for logic. You may realize that you are ready to upgrade the people around you. Um, vulnerability. Feeling vulnerable. Be mindful of that energy in the month of, in the rest of May. signs that was a very this pulls out a very low okay so in okay um, write this down okay write this down water signs in the month of may there is no boredom you have stuff to do it is not sitting around not feeling absent of anything anyone not doing it don't do it um if you're waiting on someone um, to see the value in you, like this is holding on for someone to come back, holding on for relations that you already know deep down inside ain't going no fucking where. Um, so <clears throat> it's logic, okay? In the month of May, work on, make sure you are always floating in a pool of logic. And if you're waiting on someone to um, come towards you, then now this could be for feminine energy. If you're waiting on someone to come towards you or see your worth, let's clarify. Um, this could be for a feminine energy who could be the head of household, uh, mother, provider, caretaker-ish energy. You take care of others. Others survive because your ass exists. If you're waiting on appreciation from them um, or you find yourself going through moments of just like uh, anxiety, stress, um, bubble bath, nice bubble bath is cool. Glass of wine, maybe. Uh, a glass of wine. No, not a lot in that. Come on. But, um, yeah, be aware of overwhelming or um, giving too much of yourself and not giving anything to you in the month of May. I hope y'all are just counseling a friend going through what I'm about to say. Um, so 
See, now the eights come right out on top of each other. There's something going on here, right? So if you're waiting on someone to give you the recognition or the relationship or the money, you're going to have to be crafty in the month of May. You might have to be, you might have to choose um, um, in the month of May, water signs, somebody's bumping heads. Let's just dive on in to individual readings because there is, there's a lot of back, back and forth and forth, back and forth. With someone who should, I get the energy of someone who should be contributing to the situation that they helped create. And you might be waiting on someone to make things right. And you might have to. Mm -hmm. I don't want to say it, but okay. What I heard is put, what I heard is put foot in ass. Or put a virtual foot in ass. Oh. So if you got to, okay, if you're dealing with passion, emotions, somebody who should be doing the right thing, but is being lazy or lackadaisical about it, um, emphasis on the lack. Um, watch your energy. And instead of flaming and stressing yourself, this might be an opportunity to work in a more creative and graceful way so that you don't burn yourself out. All right, now. Um, I really just get the energy of controlling your inner and outer bitch. <laughs> and I don't mean bitch is a negative, like, like, you know, um, like somebody's just testing you or um, it feels like somebody who should, I get the, I get like almost baby daddy energy. Like they going to bring some money, but then they don't, or they stall on getting things done or just somebody not, or it could be reversed. It could be a mother and a father situation and the mother's not carrying her weight or doing what she says she's going to do, or she's giving the energy of zero fucks or something of that tone. Um, it just feels like the stresses of having to deal with someone who isn't doing their best. Okay, let's go individual here. Cancer. Okay. All right. Cancer in the month of May, the rest of May. What do you need to be aware of on the watch out for? I'm just going to say this might be, uh, well, be aware of forming generalistic opinions about others around you. Be aware of um, this. Ooh. Yeah, be aware. Okay. Oh, okay. Cancer, be aware in the rest of May. Be very careful who you trust, especially with matters of money. It feels like somebody offering or putting something or offering something wanting to get involved with you with something um, and and then don't let anybody hold up your 
flow, your financial flow. If you have plans and it's about business, don't let anybody come along and go, well, wait and let me do blah, 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 blah. And then in six months, instead of right now, we're going to do this. Well, be careful of that energy. That's a test. That is a test. It's a test of um, growth and trust and what I, okay, I don't know how this works. Oversaturated thinking. Mm -hmm. If you were in the month of May, rest of May, somebody's going to talk you into a situation. You may have an ex returning or somebody that you tapped it once or twice returning. They ain't happy though. Oh, okay. What I heard was bandwagon. Not sure how that applies. Be careful of anyone who wants to jump on your bandwagon. Um, another test in the month of the rest of May. Watch your energy. Um, it feels like a moment of someone losing their grip. And how do I mean that? Oh, I get bitter, bitch. For a moment in time, like a moment, for just like a, a glistening second, you're going to see someone's complete sour energy towards you. You must be paying attention to see it. It's someone returning to your energy. They want to know if things can, they want you to start things up or be open. And a part of you being open um, enhances their self-esteem, how they feel about themselves. Be aware of being someone's own. Oh, Okay, that was weird on my elbow. Be aware of sitting. It feels like a situation where you might be sitting for a long time like this, listening to somebody um, like say things or put you into uh, an extended conversation that's really about boosting their self-esteem and trying to get on the bandwagon before the bandwagon goes away. I don't know. So, okay, so you got somebody from the past coming back. Um, doesn't mean they're going to leap out of a bush at you. Wow. But it is somebody who's really going to be trying to get your attention if you're paying attention. Um, whoever this person is, you'll know them because they might be, they might have a runner energy. Like as in they are, they may have a, mm. be aware in the month of rest of May of serial relationship artists. <laughs> be aware of that. Now, I'm not pointing no fingers. Be aware of being shopped or treated like furniture. Uh, what I heard is, ooh. Hold on. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. So in the month of May, um, be aware of having to gracefully exit what feels like um, 
Okay, I'll tell you the image I saw. I saw someone walking into an office, like, situation. Someone closing the door really quickly, like, take me. And you're like, what the fuck? Tacked. Um, so it feels like unexpected advances and gracefully exiting uncomfortable situations that make me see a porcupine. So it can be like, oh my God, like rock in a hard place. Somebody unwantingly rubbing against you in a hallway. It just, this just feels like um, forward advances that require um, really good exit plans or a really good exit that doesn't make anyone bleed is what I, my God, let's move on. Um, let's get some angel advice. Can I get out of this? Angel advice for cancer. Ew. Okay. Um, oh my God. Boy, is it a fucking test? It's the stop test. It's the stop test. So be aware of a moment of where you're gonna need to protect yourself. Um, this doesn't feel like physical assault, okay, but it feels like a like unwanted advances times 10. Ooh -wee. So be mindful of dealing with unhealthy people. Listen, this, uh, this has money attached to it also. Because we get triple eights here, so this this is a situation that has value to it of some sort, or money is there's somewhere money somewhere in there, and so graceful dealings with a situation that needs to not go further, like hey, wrong environment, like great energy, wrong environment. Um, There's some um, inner thought, but don't take too long and protect yourself, you know, be aware. But there is a masterful ending um, that you are going to be tested on in the month of May. Be aware of getting stuck or laziness in the month of May, don't do it. Uh, there may be some moving that needs to be done that isn't being done, I don't know. Be aware of not following through on things. Don't let that happen. And I, what? I hear a song, uh, is that a Disney song? A Whole New World, A New Fantastic Point of View. This is a time of growth. So do it. Enjoy the time of passion and whatever you choose that you enjoy. <laughs> Don't skip that to the curb for sure. And be mindful of your feelings at this time. Hold on. And most importantly, on top of that, oh the fuck? Be mindful of haters. Ooh. Okay, what I hear is don't stoke the flame of your haters. Focus on your own experience in the month of May. There is gonna there's just, there's just a situation that has to be gracefully ended. It could go to force, but that force could just be making the decision to say, hey. Be aware of having to deal with the others in the month of May because there are people, you're going to be dealing with people who think that you are just another one off the 
What's that belt? The uh, manufacturing belt. They do, They might think that you are just like the last one. Be aware of people having that energy. And then lastly, don't talk about it, be about it. <laughs> if you're stalling on plans or things that you know you need to get done, get it done. Also be aware of how you see things. Um, any down, sad feelings or stalling and confusion is you know, be aware of it and move through it. Get things done, move through it. This is a time of healing for some of you and growing up. All right. Let's move along. Scorpio. Oh, hold on a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Sorry. I heard I need to tell you about your money. Cancer. Oh, what the fuck? All oh, color cards. What is this? Okay. Um, you may have to fight about your money with somebody. Oh, yeah. You might have to fight with somebody about your money. One, two, underpaid is the word I heard. Don't let anybody underpay you. Some of you are choosing to be underpaid. And don't let opportunity, good opportunities pass you by. Um, Okay, could be masculine energy. Don't let your, wow, be, just be mindful of the issues or the time that is lost because you're paying attention to your nether regions. Be mindful of losing time because you're doing naughty things in the month of May. It feels like Expensive wang. Cut wang that has an expense of time. Lost time. Also be aware of battling the self. Um, like this feels like going back to old behaviors. Also moving out of that. All right. I'm done with you. Scorpio. Scorpio, what's going on with you? So what I hear is the group. The group. Let's see what you're dealing with. In the month of May. Ew. Don't let boredom be a thing. How about that? And cut. Be aware. I think this is pretty clear. Be aware of not wasting your time. What? Okay, so what Scorpio is supposed to be doing? Well, now this might... Okay, so look, you too, Scorpio. All right. Don't let I hear read the Franklin. You better think. Don't let your new found freedom, that's what's coming out, or your perception of freedom get you in trouble in the month of May. Some of you, somebody forgets in the month of May that they can 
that they're fine by themselves. You can take care of yourself. You can please yourself. Whatever that means, I don't know. Not going there. Some of you are too, don't be too focused on being alone. And if you are getting time alone, or you have a lot of time, unto yourself, you're supposed to be doing something with that. Just saying. You're supposed to be doing something with that energy. So... In the month of May, locate your intention. When you find yourself bored, um, this feels like boredom, though, where you need to be in the energy of someone else. And you don't. You're fine by yourself. Okay. In the month of May, don't forget your gratitude and your blessings. Don't be focused on the have-nots. Um, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. To be specific, in the month of May, somebody's going to cave in. And you go and invite somebody in who, who shouldn't even be allowed in the friend zone. Oh, boy. Okay. Let's further clarify that person. coming towards Scorpio that don't even deserve the friend zone because afterward there's a there's regret I don't know why I keep getting the word chunky <laughs> chunky I don't know I'm just telling you what's coming through. Whoever it is, they're a whole fucking loser. Like, like, capital L. Okay, so for some of you, this is someone you could have given your love to, or you could have shown love to, you could have shown them compassion. But they might have come through as an honest person. You found out at some point they were not. They might have held up a connection or an opportunity with you. Or they might have been lazy in sparking something up with you in the past. Could have also just been a lazy lover too. Whoever this person is, they are in lesson mode. You will, I guess that's very clear. Um, what, okay, clown. They're a clown. Um, they think that they can control your mind or that they can. Lord. This person might talk in a way like, like they have fantasies or they may tell you that they fantasized about you, specific conversation. What they're really looking for is just some type of reward. This might be somebody who wants to come through, but is it going to tell you where they've been? Not like in full. <sighs> yeah, it's an in and out energy. Someone coming away who just wants to satisfy their desires. They're a liar. They're a liar. They take the wind, the short wins. That's what's good for them. So I just wants to come to it. Be aware of that energy. Because it's in and it's out. It comes with lies. This can be someone who's in a situation already. Or they have some type of other obligation that they ain't talking about. They just want you to accept the situation quietly. Again, somebody who doesn't even deserve the friend zone. So it can't be somebody already involved. Why did I just do that? Okay. 
All right, so be aware of that. Um, yeah, be aware of open ended, open ended. People think you're gonna have open access to you. Mm. Hmm. What else does Scorpio need to know about in the month of May? Old song I hear, Bad Company. Bad Company. Oh boy, well, somebody's going to be dealing with a feminine energy in the month of May who's very combative. Um, it can be someone who is wanting you to money for nothing and the rest comes free. What? I'm just sharing what's coming through. Wow, I hope that's not the case. Uh, damn. Okay. Uh, so what came through is fake abortion. Hold on. That's weird. My foot hurt just then. Okay. Um. So weird. Listen. If somebody tells you they're pregnant and they want you to pay for it, any type of thing like that, go to the doctor with them, double check that shit or something like that. Um, just be aware of, it just feels like something around money, 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 money. Kimmy, 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 Kimmy. Somebody who's being cruel, they don't even know why. Damn. Uh, so this could be for, I don't know who this is for. Somebody's going to be dealing with a feminine energy, very chaotic energy. Um, they want to be the center of attention. High ego. It's It feels like the energy of a motherly type that needs um, multi-layer uh entitlement but it's it's like sp ultra spoiled okay so somebody's going to be dealing with feminine energy who's cutting up but they're cutting up because um, they may want uh, to be back inside of a situation or back in Maybe these. Maybe it's someone who wants to cohabitate. Someone may feel like they're on the outside or wanting to go outside. I heard trapped rats. God damn. Oh, in the month of May, you're going to have to, um, oof. Damn. Scorpio, I hope that I, Lord. So somebody in, in the month of May is going to be uh, in close spaces with hot, a uh, Mean people, not hot as an attractive, but just mean people. It feels like having to like walk on eggshells around someone, or at least look busy. It's 
Scorpio, be aware of somebody's negative ass energy. Um, throwing you off balance. Catch it and then dismiss it. Reject it. Do not accept it. Recognize that. Oh, what's going on? In the month of May, I feel like this happens more than once. Be aware of um, be aware of somebody wanting you to be as angry or as upset or mad at the world as they are. Somebody wants you to float in their cape. Somebody wants you to float in their chaos with them. I don't know if you get one of those weird soft stick pool noodle things. But you certainly should bring a life jacket if you're going to do that. Scorpio, be aware of a feminine energy that wants you to be a hater. Damn. Okay, that's corny. What I heard was they're a hater, so you should be a hater. They're a hater, you be a hater. Wouldn't you like to be a hater too? It's okay. So it's somebody doing it because that's the energy they know. Um, they're doing it because they like the, um, that's how they understand connection. Lord. Be aware of a feminine energy who only knows how to um, be in a place of chaos. Let's just a quick couple of cards on the mind of that. Uh, to clarify that energy. Well, there's the two, so. Yeah. Um, I get Aquarius. Or there just could be Aquarius energy. Maybe someone who's um, who deals with rocky relationships and they're everywhere else in life. They definitely need some healing. Be aware of a feminine energy who blames everybody else for the issues in the month of May. You're going to have to. It feels like um, if you're too close to that energy, if you know who that is, if you're too close to that energy, it becomes part of your orbit. So if you notice you feel some kind of way after dealing with that energy, be aware and catch it and. You know, don't accept it as your own energy. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what. It really, okay. I still get that energy of just be mindful of the gossip or listening to gossip that don't have shit to do with nothing going forward. Like, it just feels like energy manipulation um, from someone who wants you to join them in useless gossip. Just it's like it benefits them, but afterward it leaves you feeling drained. So be aware of that. And mm, hold on. I feel like you need to specify on catching the energy. If you catch that energy, Scorpio, uh, or like you're talking to that person and you just start feeling like your energy going down, catch it. And then, like, naturally don't hold it, but it feels like also. If it's in conversation when you feel it, shift it. Shift the conversation when it's happening. 
And it feels like a little bit of laboratory work, you know. Yep, and we hit triple zero. So it's helping yourself and the person knock off that, or at least get a, get a moment of awareness on, on how they're just ooh, fixed, focused on same shit, different day. Oh, it almost, it's like breaking a spell. Spell, not like full witch stuff, but like breaking a spell of the conversation. Um, the person saying all the negative stuff or wanting you to just trash other people. That's really what it feels like. Someone wanting you to just trash other people. And that's not in your energy. Um, so instead of getting on board, like break the spelling. Uh-huh, you dig? Anything else? Mm. Breaking that spell, you stop chasing failure and you stop um, getting, if it's a person that you normally have that type of dialogue with, but now you're cutting it, you're like, you're like, okay, enough. Um, if you do it gracefully, right? That karma, you, you start moving that type of karma energy out of your orbit. And you, you maybe you don't do it all in one night, but it can happen. It can happen. So there is um, a part of that, moving that energy out. Uh, the card even says, shh, be quiet. It's not engaging in negative conversations at the bottom. Ne engaging in negativity that solely focuses on what is damaged in self or others coming from somebody else who only talks like that. It just, it just feels like hearing how someone is charged by negativity. Like they don't know how to have nothing else going. Hearing it and then being like, you know what? That's not my energy right now. It's not my energy anymore. It's um, it's a part of the ascension too. Moving on up, okay. Scorpio, in the name. In Monet, um, you have some choices to make, right? Some of you may be wondering about future funds. In the month of May, you may be looking at your future and the tornadic activity around such. I don't know who's, I forgot whose this group is. Something about an eter eternal flame. Uh, okay. So there may be some scary disruptions. A little bit of tornado activity. Time before everything is lost. Um, you may be worried about funds in the month of May. And you may be considering giving up or just being unhappy or not sure what's next. So be in control of your emotions. Consider options is what I heard. So, okay, in the month of May, um, somebody, Scorpio, somebody gets uh, a moment, a moment where you're going to have to Consider other options for funding, financing, money. But, the, and, but remember that you can. Remember that you can. 
Some of you are getting like a moment of awakening because you're the one that's got to come out of it and you can, what else do I have? Okay, so. Some of you are getting a light, a light on your ass, light up your ass, something like that. Fire up your ass, something, I don't know. Uh, some of you are getting a moment of like, whoa, shit could change. Shit could really fucking change. Um, and you're getting this moment of awareness so that you can act a little bit faster than the others. Could be a masculine energy. You're getting a signal before others. You're getting a signal before others go crazy. Um, in the month of May, some kind somebody, Scorpio, be paying attention. Be paying attention. Somebody's gonna tell you something that's gonna drive everybody else crazy, but you have an opportunity to deal with it before others go crazy. You're gonna get a secret that's gonna be some. Crazy shit. You get a secret about time. What's coming? Ew. What you do? Okay. Anything else? Shit. It's about money. And how others are going to react. So you get an opportunity to put yourself ahead of the game. Scorpio. Don't skip out on the... It the opportunity because you'll be in a place of want later. Yeah, don't wait. Okay, I hear nine inch nails. I was up above it. Now I'm down in it. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Maybe it means something to you, Scorpio. I'm done, nonetheless. So let's move on, Pisces. What? Okay, that's weird, Pisces. What I hear is gravy train. <laughs> I promise you I'm not hungry. Let's see what's going on. Pisces. The rest of May, what's going on, Pisces? Oh, Pisces in the month of rest of May, rather. <laughs> in the rest of May. Um, don't do don't start bad habits because you're feeling alone. And be mind. Don't explain yourself to others. Let's see. Don't let your genitals get you in trouble. <laughs> the rest of May, don't let your junk get you in trouble. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You are manifesting lack. 111 in reverse. Don't let your loneliness. Lonely is a state of mind. Okay? It's a state of mind. And so there's an illusion that needs to be dealt with the way you see things. Um, for somebody, there's a way of thinking that needs to change. Somebody's not dealing with a breakup or an ending of a relationship in the healthiest way. Be aware of that. Be aware of focusing on being very, being too focused on what you can have. I see a buffet. I see a buffet. So maybe there's, maybe someone came out of a relationship and they're dry humping everything in sight. Be mindful. Be mindful of picking up bad habits. Um, wow. 
yeah, be mindful of picking up bad habits that turn into bad, worse habits. Pisces, be mindful of someone from somebody's got a someone from the past coming back. Um, this could be someone who was abusive or a user. Could be, I get the energy of uh, if they weren't physically abusive, there's drugs or maybe both. Something about you makes it comfortable for them with their bad habit. Um, oh, Pisces. Hopefully you're not the advanced level liar. Somebody's dealing with an advanced level liar in the month of May. Uh, this could be somebody trying to get back into your good graces, but they still don't like you. They still want to use pump, dump, run. It's something that should have, you know, not even started. So it wouldn't have to stop. I just heard sour patches. <laughs> See, we have somebody who's a childless, childish and bitter person. Because their heart is broken, but in an angry way. So in the month of May, protect yourself from people from the past who you know motherfucking well you ain't resolved nothing with. Don't invite them in. Be mindful of that. Protect your space. Protect your head space. I hear check the vibe. <laughs> so maybe that's how you'll know whether you should let them around. Yeah, you got the pretenders. Coming through. So, an opportunity to, you have an opportunity to deal with fake motherfuckers who are on some bitter shit. So, it can't be energies coming through to use you, whoever they are, from the past. They already showed you what a piece of shit they was already. They already showed you that shit. So, what the fuck? Why would you let them come back? And it's it can be the oh watch it. What I hear is codependency. Be careful of that or recognize it in yourself. You can be codependent to a someone who drinks or use drugs. You could be codependent um, to someone who is abusive. Uh, you could be codependent and watching someone being abused and doing nothing. But there's an energy that you may be letting back into your space in the month of May um, because you're bored or lonely. And that's perception. So stop doing that. Just be mindful. You have somebody who's coming back into your space focused. They're very focused on the haves and the have nots. And I'm not saying they're going to plot and plan your ruin, but they may have a hand in your in 10 less smiley faces. How about that? But it is somebody who mental. Pisces, you may be mental. You may be dealing with somebody who makes you mental. But what they really are is envious. Hopefully you're not the one that's envious. I don't think may. But if you do have somebody coming back into your space, be mindful of letting haters get close to you, okay? It just feels like filling this space, uh, filling your
personal space up with the wrong energies. Don't do that. What else is coming on for Pisces? You can't always get what you want. But if you try, you might get what you need. Song, right? Hey, message. <clears throat> Pisces in the month of May. Don't let anybody extinguish your flames, your fire, your passion for self. Do And watch sad feelings. Watch negative energy. You're gonna to need to block that shit. You got to be very limited on how much interaction you do with sad people. And when I say sad, I don't mean like people who are in bad situations. I mean people who just only see the dark shit because it becomes your world too. Be aware of waiting on things that aren't for you. Um, let's check this access stuff. Damn. Listen, that's all I got for you here, Pisces. <laughs> that's all I got for you here. Be mindful who the fuck you let your energy. Somebody's letting somebody in who may drink. Um, whoever it is, if there's some chemical chosen things put into someone, be mindful of letting them into your energy. They are using you like furniture and got the nerve to have a bad attitude on top of it. Bad energy. Be aware of pe letting people into your space who are bad energy and when I they're bad energy and you can't Tell them that. That's weird. Like, you know their energy's fucked up, but you can't talk about it. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, you're limited on what you can say to them, or they don't listen, because they just... They just want... I hear, I want it all, and I want it now. Yeah, you just... <laughs> Somebody just wants to be heard. They just value in you listening. But it becomes a part of your energy too. It's in your energetic force field. Be aware. Be aware of somebody finding value in taking you to the dump with them. Jeez. In the month of May, be aware of how someone's energy or somebody's chaotic side or chaotic tendencies. Be aware of how that takes from you. Make different In this month, you have the opportunity to make choices about money, finance, what's valuable to you. And it feels like being treated like... It feels like being treated like somebody's piece of furniture, being one purpose, one use to someone. It feels like in the month of May, you are aware of subtraction and how maybe someone treats you like you are. I'm over here making up words. I don't know if this is subtractable. <laughs> you are worthy of subtraction. Like, okay. They'll deal with you and they want you to do this, but otherwise go fuck yourself. Like it's. I really do get this emphasis on someone who might drink. Or they like a drink here and there, but that's a secret. 
it feels like you're seeing someone's, um, you're seeing, you're just seeing someone's party side in a different way or their whatever this is. You're just, you're running out of hope on someone in the month of May. Someone's not growing, not going to change, not going to stop bringing you the chaotic, demanding self. Um, it's like the forever brat. <sighs> I feel drained, Pisces. Don't let that happen to you in the month of May. Get you some angel cards. Right. So there's loving the self, right? Loving the self, love your time. Love your life. Be mindful of making emotional choices or letting feeling bad for people. What I heard is histrionics. Be mindful of people who are good at crying. What? Some people are just, okay. You're going to be dealing with somebody who's just, it might even be more than one, Pisces. People who are just emotional because that's how they understand human connections, attention. And so there has to be some awareness of that so that you don't always gotta be a part of the emotional response. Be aware of dealing with people who don't follow through on things. Be aware of you not following through on stuff in the month of May. But for some of you, this is regarding um, something you know you need to get done. Ooh, okay, uh, Pisces, be aware of copying old data. Somebody's copying, or you might, hopefully you realize in the month of May that you're copying um, a parent's behavior. So it feels like the energy of someone who like might have had a parent who did this, but never got to do that. And you might be doing some of the things at this time that stop you like the parent was stopped. Yeah. Be aware of starting a karma a, a karma process. So you gotta get to move in, move your butt. Um, some of you will be battling the self to get things done or to get more energy. Get that too. So in the month of May, the rest of May. Pisces, maybe getting to know yourself, know your new self. That's weird. In the meantime, you, uh, smiling is a choice, just like anger is a choice. You're finding out more about yourself in the month of May. And you may be silencing your interactions with people so that you can get your mind right. And that's okay. And for those of you who are creatives, protect your, okay. If you're an artist or you're thinking about doing artistic things, in the rest of May at least, be mindful who you share your goods with. 
protect your work, protect your ideas. And I don't think you have thieves per se, as much as you have people who may discourage you because they're immature dorks. Be aware of sharing your gifts or your good ideas with people who don't fucking have good ideas. Because it feels like somebody's shooting down a perfectly great idea. And it's something that, it feels like someone taking a punch at something artistic that you're doing or that you create or an idea that you have to create. Like you might tell a friend, I'm going to paint this. I'm going to paint a pair of sunglasses next to a stream of water. <laughs> and your friend who can't paint at all might tell you that's the dumbest shit I ever heard of. And then like 10 days later, a painting just like that sells for a billion dollars. Don't listen to other people when it comes to ideas about your art. Um things that you are personally creating that, you know, are part of your gift. Ugh. Be aware of people. Just protect your gifts. Protect your fucking gifts from people who ain't got no damn gifts. Um, and uh, real quick for Pisces Finance. And then uh, in the month of May, you might hear about some work. Somebody might tell you about, okay, somebody might offer you uh, some type of job or work. But it's going to require you move real fast. Like yesterday. <laughs> it And I don't know if this is a physical move. But it feels like it was something offered to others. So I get the impression of a job or work opportunity. Um, But it may impact someone close to you also. So a lot of things have to shift. Like minds, minds, people's minds also got to shift. Um, feels like the energy of happy for one blockages and concern for another. If you do get a sudden offer, Pisces, look that shit up. Really, 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 really. Really, 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 really. Do your homework before it going far in investments at this time. Do your homework and then some. Be aware of being manipulated by the desires of someone else. I heard market manipulation. Yeah, okay. Um, okay, I have some money too. Be careful of people just trying to get you to move real fast on something that's really going to benefit them. This can be um, act now type of stuff. Or a great opportunity if you just do these things in order. Oh, um, also, Pisces, if you have older people around you 
who don't know current scams in the month of May, be on the lookout for that. I feel like <clears throat> I feel like someone's elder, elderly person, grandparent, parent, somebody who doesn't know all of the latest scams. Um, it feels like educating an elderly person in your life. about catfish <laughs> and not talking openly to anybody. <sighs> I do see concern about money though. So there, if, if someone is looking for work, there are opportunities. There's plenty of doors you have keys for. So if there's funds you need it, you've got to be creative at this time. But I don't see any major issues around money for you specifically, can I see? But I do keep getting this inform this this something about your money and react now. So be aware of people wanting you to put your money in or your precious time in on shit you ain't getting paid for. Be careful of that. Cause it feels like somebody's selling you some bullshit ass dreams. Someone wants to take advantage of someone. Um, and don't forget to give elderly people around you information. Yeah. It feels like someone's elder gets conned by someone on the phone. So be very mindful of um, teaching people or my, uh, just reminding about telemarketers. Maybe conversation with a grandparent or an older parent. It wouldn't be a bad thing. Anyways, all right. Um, I hope that was helpful. And if it was, like, comment, subscribe right now. That's good. And I'll give you guys a couple, ooh, wait a minute overall energy for water signs in the month of May. Yeah, watch your distractions. Bad, bad thing distractions get you in trouble. Stay busy. Also get your rest though. Stay busy because if you're busy, you don't see the bullshit. Hmm? But if you're focused on the bullshit, you can look right at it. You can. Be mindful of the energy that you take in at this time. This is a time where certain energetic forces are manipulating energy. So be aware of the energy of harm and sabotage at this time. Make sure you're not expressing that outward too. Um, at this time, be aware of the influence of haters. Mm -hmm. Something about the month of May. Uh, people are going to just, you be aware of the energy of haters. The influence of haters. And how a loss of sense can happen. Uh, it feels like an opportunity to be aware of what you vibrate out and what can stay in your orbit and how that affects us on the physical plane. So it just feels like a, a moment of reflection uh, from watching other people. 
watching others live their lives. It feels like a moment of understanding how words have an effect on people. Spell casting. It's a, a month of moody people. So watch out. Don't embrace no dark energy as your own if it's not yours. Another reason to focus on nice art, keep your comedy playlist tight and um, see the good in yourself. See the good in others. And most importantly, stay safe. It's a wild world out there and it's going to get wilder to say the least. All right. Thank you so much for being here. I am done. I hope that uh, the week or the rest of May <laughs> treats you wonderfully. So I'll see you next time, okay? You are well. Remember that. And be that. Until next time.